You can now build Node.js web apps with Windows Subsystem for Linux. Use your favorite Linux tools, integrated with your favorite Windows tools, add the VS Code remote extension, and you write, test, and debug in VS Code on Windows while your app runs on Linux in a local Linux server. We'll show you how to get started. To set up your Windows 10 machine for Node.js work, we recommend first installing WSL2, as it has significant performance improvements over WSL1. We also recommend installing Visual Studio Code, along with the remote WSL extension. This extension splits VS Code into a client-server architecture, with your user interface running on the Windows client, but your code, Git, and plugins running on a Linux server. You can open the integrated bash terminal and run commands, build your projects, use linting and IntelliSense, just like you would from a native Linux environment. Next, install Node Version Manager so that we can easily switch to whatever version of Node we need. You could also use N, FNM, NVS, or Volta for your version management if you prefer. Now let's take a look at a common workflow by using Node Package Manager to install the Next.js React framework and create a server-rendered web app project. By using npm create, we are directly using the Next package from the npm registry to create this project without needing to install it. Open the directory and start a local development server. Once your project is built, your terminal will provide a local host link where you can view your app running locally in a web browser. Make a change in your VS Code file, and notice how the hot reload feature automatically updates your browser. We can also see how Next handles errors and use VS Code for debugging. With WSL2 and the VS Code remote extension, you can create Node.js web apps with Linux commands, run the app on a local Linux server, and then use VS Code on Windows to code. View your app running in a browser and debug, all while maintaining access to your favorite productivity tools like Office and Outlook. To learn more about using Node.js on Windows, including working with MongoDB, Postgres, or Docker containers, head here 